to make a balsa wood plane, you're going to need a pen or pencil, um, scissors or a knife, three, two or three thin sheets of balsa wood, um, and some cardboard. So first, you are going to take the cardboard and use and design a wing shape, body shape, and um, a tail shape for the plane. Now, if you have the um, shape you want, you're going to cut them out. So, now you have your three pieces that you drew and cut out. And to attach them, you're going to need to have like a little slot to put them through on like the wing and tail, wherever you want it. And you can really pretty much just do any shape. you want. So, you can just like do it. Sometimes it's kind of hard. Um, so I'm just cutting the slot and I did a little cut on the wing to so the wing stays in place better. And then I'm just putting on the wing, and then hoping it's going to stay straight. Y you need the cardboard to make um, like cardboard planes before you make the balsa planes, because if you mess up on the balsa planes, it's worse than just messing up on something else, So because if you don't have much balsa wood, because this is all I really have. You want to use a cardboard to um, make the plane before you actually make the balsa wood plane. And you really can just like make every different shapes and just ex experiment with it. The plane, and now you just test it out. And now we're going to test it out and see how good it works. And you can like change the angle of the wings and stuff and keep trying it out until you come up with a design that you like. Um, these are all the planes that I've tried and this is the plane that I decided on. And after you've got your um, plane that you want, you're going to want to take whatever you're going to carve it with the um, plain outline that you like wanted and your balsa wood and so then you're gonna take your balsa wood and cardboard and put it on and then however you want it and then you're just gonna trace it Um, now you have all the pieces um, cut out, and you have to make the slits. So now you have all your slots cut out, and you have both um, your tail and your wing piece. You and then when you you just take the piece, you can you don't have you can like center it, but you don't have to. So you just insert it and then if you made the slots a bit too big you can just use some tape you can also um secure it by putting tape on it secure the wings in place and now we're ready to fly it <laughs> 